Welcome everyone. Today we're going to install the new stable cascade model developed by Stability AI. It's particularly amazing for working with text and hands. We're going to walk through the simple steps to get Stable Cascade up and running on Comfy UI. Plus, I'll show you how to quickly fix a common error that might pop up when you try it out for the first time. First off, head over to the GitHub repository created by Kijai. You'll want to copy the page link. Then navigate to your Comfy UI folder, dive into another folder also named Comfy UI, and then into the custom nodes folder. Here, click on the address bar and type CMD to open the command prompt. Now type git clone, add a space, paste the GitHub link you copied earlier, and hit enter. Once that's done, you'll find a new folder named Comfy UI Diffuser Stable Cascade in your directory, which we just cloned. Next, we need to install some requirements. Find the requirements.txt file in the folder we just cloned, copy its path, and save it temporarily in a notepad. After that, head back to the main Comfy UI folder, open the command prompt again, and prepare to copy a code I've left in the video description below. Append the path of the requirements.txt file to this code to start installing all the necessary components. Wait for the process to complete and then you're all set to launch the Comfy UI web interface. Using Stable Cascade is a breeze. It features a single node where you can adjust all your settings. The first time you try to generate an image, you'll need to download the Cascade model along with a few other files, so it might take a bit longer. If you encounter an error that prevents you from generating images, don't worry, it's an easy fix. Follow a path I've included in the description. You need to replace in your own username to access the decoder folder. Inside, we'll need to tweak the config.json file. If you have Notepad++ or any code editor, use it to open the file. Look for line 45 and replace c underscore in with in underscore channels. Save your changes, head back to ComfyOI, and try generating an image again. This time, you should encounter no errors and Stable Cascade should work perfectly. If you find this video helpful, push the like button and hit subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you for watching and see you soon.